Hi everyone, I'm John Odin. I work with the development team here at Boson Software. Thanks for stopping by to take a look at this video overview of our XM Max for Cisco 640-822 ICND-1 practice exam. This product is an exam simulation that will help you as you prepare to take the Cisco 640-822 exam. Our Boson XM Max practice exams offer extensive coverage of the topics you'll need to master so that you can be successful in achieving your IT certification goals. Okay, let's get started. First, let's take a look at what's required to gain your Cisco CCNA certification. That's Cisco Certified Network Associate certification. One way to do it is to take and pass the Cisco 64802 CCNA exam. This exam covers all of the Cisco CCNA topics in a single exam. Check out the training and certification page at the Cisco website for a complete list of the topics covered on the exam. The 64802 CCNA exam covers quite a lot of material and can be rather challenging. Another way to gain your CCNA certification is to follow the two exam path that covers the same CCNA topics but splits them across two separate exams. These two exams are the 64822 ICND-1 exam and the 64816 ICND-2 exam. After you take and pass the 64822 ICND-1 exam, you will earn a relatively new certification from Cisco, which is the Cisco Entry Network Technician, or CCENT. After you've passed your ICND-1 exam, you would then take the 64816 ICND-2 exam. After you've passed that exam, presuming you've already passed the ICND-1 exam, you would then receive your Cisco CCNA certification. These are just two different ways to earn the same certification. The best option for you would depend upon your level of knowledge and experience. If you're just starting out, you may want to take the two exam option. If you have more experience and are more familiar with the material, you may choose to take the single exam option and take only the 64802 CCNA exam. One point worth noting is that if you take the two exam option, you will have two certifications, the CCENT and the CCNA, whereas if you take the single exam option, you would have only the CCNA certification. We build our practice exam products to provide you with the most realistic simulations available for IT certification exams. This is our exam delivery engine that we call the BOSUN Exam Environment, or the BEE. The BEE displays all of your available exam content. I'm going to select and load the BOSUN XM Max practice exam for 64822. After the exam loads, you can see that this product contains three complete exams, each of which simulates the experience of taking the certification exam at the testing center. Each exam contains a selection of the types of questions that you could see when you take the certification exam. I'm going to start this exam in study mode so that I get immediate feedback to let me know if I've chosen the correct answer. In study mode, there is no timer and I can choose to display an explanation to assist in learning the concept covered by the question. Cisco certification exams can have a variety of question types that you might encounter, and our practice exams simulate these question types. Here you see we have a basic multiple choice question where you examine the diagram and some additional information and select the best answer. Since I'm in study mode, I can click the show answer button and I can see that I have made an incorrect choice and the explanation shows me why that choice is incorrect and also it shows me why the correct choice is correct. We can see that there's a lot of detailed information here and each explanation is like a mini lesson on that particular exam topic or topics. And at the end, we can see that there are references that I can follow for further study. Our practice exams simulate a number of different interactive question types. And here is an example of the drag and drop question type. We're given a panel of choices on the left and a column of targets on the right and a problem statement at the top. Our challenge is to select the correct choice from the left and drag it and drop it onto the right target over on the other side. Once again, I'm in study mode, so I can click the Show Answer button to see if I've worked through the question correctly. I can see here that I have not, but I do have a diagram that I can refer to that shows me the correct sequence of choices and the targets that, that they should be dropped on. 
as well as an explanation that shows me why. And just like before, I have additional references that I can follow for further study. Another question type that you could encounter is called a simlet. In the simlet question type, you're given a simulated network topology, and then you have the ability to interact with the device or devices in the simulated network topology. You can see that I've clicked on a router and I have access now to the router's device console from which I could look at the configuration and derive the information that I need in order to answer the questions in the simlet. That concludes this overview of our Boson XM Max for Cisco 64822 ICND1 practice exam with a look at a few of the different question types that make up the product. Thank you for taking time to view this video. You can learn more about all of our BOSUN practice exams as well as our BOSUN NetSim Network Simulator by visiting us on the web at BOSUN.com.